celebrating the Tiff Suite or the Spring Festival, the music, the dancing, the wedding ceremonies, all Amazigh customs that date back centuries. It's their way of life and their traditions, which they say Colonel Gaddafi's regime tried to end. Remembering their days of war in their own unique way. They fought first against the Italian colonizers and then the Gaddafi regime. He didn't want us to speak in our language. He wanted to diminish our identity. Now, when you come to the mountain, you smell freedom. The revolution united us with our Arab brothers against the tyrant. But the festivities are marred by a wave of ethnic and tribal fighting in other parts of the country, which are threatening not only the revolution, but the future of Libya. Officials who would never have attended this festival under Gaddafi downplayed the threat. This is why we had the 17th of February revolution. What for? We had it. For, we, need, we want the democracy. We want the justice. We want equal uh, opportunity. We want uh, institutions. Politics aside, it's time for the people of Nalut to flock to their historical fort. Now crowned with their symbol. The Spring Festival for the Amazigh this year has a special feeling. That is the first time in decades they are able to hold it without the restrictions imposed by Colonel Gaddafi's regime. They are keen to maintain their heritage and equally keen on the unity of Libya. For Nalut, it's a new spring and a new generation seeking a new future. Omar Saleh, Al Jazeera, Nalut.